Hi, Tony Vernetti with Enphase Energy here. In California, there are thousands of homeowners with solar systems under NEM 1.0 and NEM 2.0 agreements. Many of these homeowners now consume more energy than they generate, resulting in an expensive true-up bill. They'd love to add more solar, but have been limited to adding only about two panels before losing their NEM 1.0 or 2.0 status, until now. With Enphase, these homeowners can add as much solar as they want without losing their preferred NEM status. Here's how it works. First of all, the existing solar system can't be modified in any way. You can't add more panels or upgrade components. The solution includes the installation of a new expansion system on the home. Both systems will operate independently. The existing solar system can continue to export energy to the grid for credit from the utility, but none of the energy from the expansion system can be exported to the grid. This is why system sizing is so important. An expansion system should generate enough energy to cover what's being purchased from the grid. For example, if the home's energy consumption is 12,000 kilowatt hours per year, and the existing solar system produces 8,000 kilowatt hours per year, the owner will want an expansion system which produces the difference of 4,000 kilowatt hours per year. In the future, if the homeowner plans to purchase an electric vehicle or other major electric appliance like an air conditioner, they'll want an even bigger expansion system. There are three different ways an expansion system can be installed. Zero export, using Enphase power control software. Circuit relocation, which involves moving circuits to a sub-panel. Or a net generation output meter. We recommend zero export with Enphase power control software. It's the most cost-effective way to comply with the utility requirements. With power control, the system will manage energy generated by the expansion system to ensure it never exceeds the needs of the home. Here are a couple more things to keep in mind. When using zero export with Enphase power control, only the expansion system may have batteries. And any added batteries can only be charged by the expansion system. When using the net generation output meter, either the existing or the expansion system may have batteries, but not both. Adding battery storage to an expansion system is a great way to avoid expensive peak rates. A battery will store excess solar energy that can be used in the late afternoon and evening after the sun goes down when rates are at their highest. Enphase expansion systems work great for existing Enphase systems, but they also work great for existing systems that aren't Enphase. With system expansions, you can now support your customers' increasing energy needs and quickly create new business from your existing fleet. Check our links below for more information including sample diagrams and design guidelines. Thanks for watching.